East Skowhegan Police Department has a new member with a special skill. Kenichi Lawrence introduces us to this four-legged officer. It has been since the 1980s that the Skowhegan Police Department had a canine of any type. That all changed last week when the department chose a black lab to join their team. It was a connection like no other. The chief and I looked at each other and said, that's the dog. After looking at three dogs from a breeder in Connecticut, 14-month-old Reese was the one. His handler, Joshua York, says it was his drive. We hit his ball from him, and he just wouldn't give up until he came back with it. So that's what we're looking for, um, just the never give up. It is an important trait to have for an important role. Reese's only job is going to be sniffing out narcotics. Uh, he's going to be a single purpose canine unit that uh, only focuses on drugs. Skowhegan Police Chief David Bucknam says they've needed the dog for many years to help curb the drug problem in the area. Right now, uh, the drug epidemic uh, in the United States is just out of control. And what we are really hoping is to provide the, the assistance, the help that people with substance abuse need. And we have many programs right here in Skowhegan through Kennebec Behavioral Health, Somerset Public Health, Reddington Fairview Hospital. And we want to get those folks the help they need. Bucknam says sometimes it takes a bad moment to get the people the help they need. And that's where Reese comes in. Most people hide, uh, hide their drugs from us. So uh, he's gonna need to be able to look and search for that until uh, until he's absolutely sure he either can't find it or he does ultimately come up with it. Reese will also be able to help other agencies, but first comes training. Starting on August 28th, um, he and I will be going to the Maine Criminal Justice Academy for 10 weeks. There, they'll teach him everything from obedience to narcotics detection. Our ultimate goal is to see people that have substance abuse recover and carry on a normal life, and we're really hoping that K9 Reese will help us make that happen. Kodichi Lawrence, WABI-TV5 News, Skowhegan.